channel so today's topic is about how do you write an internship report and what are the different contents that should be covered in an internship report so firstly as soon as you begin you need to have a college logo at the top of the page and on the first page it should be clearly mentioned what is your training is it a hospital training is it a clinical training is it an industrial training where have you actually performed your internship where have you actually completed your internship from and there are few very big specifications about the page the pagination and the format like there should be a border proper header and a footer and proper page number at the top uh, the, at the la bottom of the page so that is very very essential and on the next line you have to mention about the name of the place where you have performed if it's an hospital name of the hospital which industry or which clinical firm it is which organization have you worked for then you have to write your name and the designation or affiliation and the date on which you have submitted on the next page comes the table of contents so in the table of contents you have to first write the acknowledgement the, uh, these points must be covered and proper page number for the same it should not be too long neither it should be too short it's a report so it should clearly specify and clearly communicate what have you learned what have you performed and what are the different characteristics of your this one month journey at the internship place so in the acknowledgement you can write whatever the people who have supported you the people who have helped you during the internship or to get that internship you can thank them the next on the next page comes the image of the certificate uh, there would be a certificate that would be provided to you at the end of one month like this uh, somewhat you have to add that image or if you want you can attach the image as a supplement or as a uh, attachment but it's better that you incorporate it in the word document itself and one very important thing whenever you're going for an internship whatever you're doing every day no i know it's a tiring from semester six you have just come up it's difficult for you to write but see to it that you write it appropriately and whatever you have done on that day you at least write bullet points so that at the end when you're making a report you won't feel it hectic it, it would only be difficult for you to recollect that ha maine kya kiya tha mujhe yaad nahi aa raha maine kya kya cheeze ki thi so you can write every single small details like in hospital if you have seen high risk medications if you have seen look alike sound alike drugs if you have industry if you have made some beads or if industry if you have done some research or some tablets so see to it that you mention that in your report the next is the information about the place where you have worked in like uh, suppose if it's a hospital or if it's an industry so if if it's um, what is that industry all about what is that hospital all about where is it located and what are the different um, services that are provided what are the different shifts that are provided you need to mention that in your report that is very very essential next up comes the you can add few images according to your convenience because images always make things better so it's better that you incorporate it in image as well so this is the information that what all things were present in the hospital what are the disinfection procedures what are the different formularies the drug interaction procedures etc next up in thing you need to write about the knowledge acquired what all things you actually came to know when you performed the internship what were the different skills you learned like we were made to go through three different phases in patient pharmacy outpatient pharmacy and emergency pharmacy there were three different pharmacies and we were we in these 30 days they were divided into 10 days each section so what all things we learned in inpatient prescription reading what the ways in which the medications are arranged reading the prescriptions or and then communicating it with the customer the patient customer relationship is very very ex extremely important you make them understand the dose the dosage the uh, contraindications and different kinds of all the things associated with the expiry date the manufacturing date the instructions for use any special instructions to keep away from children or so so all those things you can mention here that you have learned next up these were the equipments that we were shown the other methods for sterilization the methods of patient care and the next header comes the description of the experience now you have uh, just firstly given the brief about what were the knowledge you acquired now in detail what have you learned what are the patient safety care the forms the ptc pharmacy therapeutic committee if the clinical pharmacy over there or the hospital pharmacy there would be someone who would be supervising you so what was his description about the different job profile the, your internship profile so a to z you have to it, this part should give a bird eye view 
इट शुड गिव बर्ड आई व्यू ऑफ योर एंटायर इंटर्नशिप वन मंथ मतलब पर्सन शुड अंडरस्टैंड देख के समझ आना चाहिए कि हाँ चलो दिस पर्सन हैज गॉन थ्रू दीज दीज थिंग्स एंड ट्राई टू यूज इमेजेस ट्राई टू कैप्चर पिक्चर्स इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज पिक्चर्स मेक योर रिपोर्ट लुक वेरी मोर कैप्टिवेटिंग सो दीज आर द डिफरेंट टर्मिनोलॉजीज दैट वी वर मेड टू एवेद एफ एस एन ई ओ क्यू फर्स्ट इन फर्स्ट आउट सो द प्रोडक्ट दैट कम्स इन फर्स्ट शुड बी मूवड आउट और शुड बी डिस्पेंसड फर्स्ट बिकॉज इट्स एक्सपायरी डेट वुड बी नियर आउट सो दैट इज अवर कंसेप्ट दैट इज ऑप्टेन वाइटल देर आर सर्टन मेडिकेशन दैट आर एक्सट्रीमली वाइटल एंड आर नीडेड सर्टन आर एसेंशियल्स वेल सर्टन आर लेस नीडेड सो दे आर अकॉर्डिंगली कैटेगोरिकली डिवाइडेड दिस इज अ नाकॉटिक स्टोरेज एरिया सो यू नीड टू मैंशन स्मॉल इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट योर Uh, experience and then you can conclude it in your particular way what all you learned what all you came to know and that's it that's it for the report this is how you write the report i would show you i would like to show you the page see this the in first page and you see to it that you give the proper header footer page number borders line spacing line spacing is very important it should be either 1 or 1.15 or 1.5 max the data should be properly justified numbering should be appropriate spelling errors should be checked and most important no plagiarism your report should be free from plagiarism acknowledgement image of the certificate information about the hospital the, and the next is the knowledge that you have acquired the next is the description of the knowledge of the experience and finally you can conclude so this is how you write a report i hope you all would have understood it and would looking forward for your great reports to come up thank you so much